Hey everybody, how's it going? It's RGJ Runner here, and we're and we're back. Well, we're not back exactly. We're back playing a new game, though. I'm need to dark descent. Just finished downloading it there off Steam, and yeah, I know, cliche. Everybody plays this game. PewDiePie, Mark Blair, Danny Mash, all the big Ness players. Oh, and Rudolph Gamer, one of my favorites. I mean, he gets so little attention, but he deserves so much. Okay. En enough chicha, let's get into it, okay. Or GJ Runner. Yeah, I'm kinda of slow typing. Oh well. If that's what I wanna be. Okay, and we're gonna start a new game. Wonder what terrifying adventures await us. And that is a sunny baby face with blood oozing out from the eye, the nose, the mouth. I'm not sure what it is. It's like the fucking sun from the Teletubbies, except more gory. <gasps> Some things mustn't be forgotten. The shadow hunting me. I must hurry. My name is Daniel. I live in London at... at... Uh, Mayfair. What have I done? This is crazy. Don't forget. Don't forget. I must stop him. Focus. My name is... I am Daniel. Alrighty then. Lost of darkness. Oh no, wait, wait, wait. What's this? Did we awaken from a wild party of some kind? Jeez, you bloody wrecked the place, man. Fair play to you. Look, look at this shit. The fucking ceiling is leaking here. I'm not sure what kind of party you threw back then. Jeez. All we do with our house parties or get, is, bleh, is get our housemates kicked out. Or flatmates, whatever you want to call them. Not that that's ever happened to me. Or any of my friends. Oh, hint! Tinder boxes are used. Ugh! Tinder boxes are used to light camps and other light sources. Okay, yes. Thanks for the update, Captain Obvious. Oh yeah, I, picked, I already picked up one, jeez. But I'm not going to use it just yet. Because I know I'll probably be using it, or I'll probably be needing it later on. It's just too damn bright now. And get up you wimp, wimpity wimp, wimp, wimp. What are you doing? Okay, guess we're not going that way. Some strange reason unbeknownst to me. Another tinder box and what looks to be a lab coat. Oh, can we take the lab coat? No, we can't. How oh, unfortunate. Okay. You nice fire. We got a cheer. Warm ourselves up, sit down. No, can't do that. The game isn't that real. And I see. We fancied ourselves the old drink as we normally do right here in Ireland. Shit, where'd it go? That's ah, screw it. We can stay one day sober. Okay, we're going to follow the pink blood, the pink, the, the pink, 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 the pink rose petals, pink blood, pink liquid, whatever you want to call it. Don't judge me. Don't like being judged. Actually, no, I don't mind. Hehe. <laughs> Looks like we're going a bit sideways. For some reason. 
Hopefully we won't crack a brick when we hit the wall. Nobody will get that, I get it. Did I hear somebody running? Did oh, no. It's just my imagination. <laughs> will you quit that? Ain't that scary? What are you doing? Pick yourself up, man. Oh, the game is freaking glitching out of me. Please pick yourself up. Doing that shit. Ooh, spooky door. Maybe we can take refuge in here. Maybe it's a gateway to Narnia. But if we never try, we'll never know. Grr, what's it? There, that's a bit more room now. Just move the microphone. To Narnia. No? No? No Narnia? No portal? No, no nothing? Okay, fine. Whatever. Didn't want to go there anyway. Grrr, would you close the damn thing? Just in case something pops out. Even though there's nothing in there, but still. Hey buddy, how you doing? Don't lose your head, man. Why are you doing that? And in yet an, yet again, another tinder box. And this guy is freaking out. What's up with his vision, man, really? He seems to be going wobbly. Woo! Beware when setting in darkness, your sanity will slowly drain. Turn on lights in, inventor, in the inventory. You, uh, in the in environment. Oh, I think that was an inventory. Environment using tinder boxes or search for other sources of light. Is he not scared of the dark? Really? It wasn't it wasn't even dark? Jeez, man. The other children cheered him on. His name voiced in a steadily rising pace, urging him to do it. Am I really doing this? The young boy thought and struck his victim with a rock. Who is this boy and why is he striking his victim with a rock? Jeez, children back back then. They were violent little tricks. Then again, we're all violent little tricks in our own way. Even me. This is not helping my character. And there seems to be nothing here. Except this box. And apparently I have superhuman strength, I can throw things like a mile away. But you can do that in real life. You know, just up a random innocent bystander will go pa pow sort of like uh, Superman he'd be able to do all that crazy shit boy that's all I came in here for tinder boxes I start my own shop selling tinder boxes they seem to be been plenty in this game in this here game you're trying to be a plenty of tinder boxes A lantern that fell off the table. Okay, fine. Okay, time check. How long have I been recording this? Eh, we can spend another few minutes. At least another minute or so. Because I'm just pouring through this. I'll be honest, I've played up as far as the sort of tutorial part. Up until we get to the main hallway, as I'll call it. So I know this area pretty well, so it, so I haven't been getting, you know, frightened. When I first played through it, I was getting kind of scared, but not this time. Maybe once you've done it once, you know, you know what to expect. Therefore, it loses loses its effect on the mind.
Yada yada yada. More tinderboxes. Great. In fact, I actually did try to record this before, but unfortunately it didn't come out right. The game audio didn't record. The commentary recorded. Or I recorded my commentary perfectly, but game audio, no. I messed up the settings. Okay, we have to go over here and read this note. 19th of August, 1839. I wish I could ask how much you remember. I don't know if there will be anything left after I consume this drink. Don't be afraid, Daniel. I can't tell you why, but know this. I choose to forget. Try to find comfort and strength in that fact. There is a purpose. You are my final effort to put things right. God willing, the name Alexander of Brandenburg still invokes bitter anger in you. If not, this will sound horrible. Go to the inner sanctum, find Alexander, and kill him. His body is old and weak, and yours, young and strong. He will be no match for you. One last thing. A shadow is following you. It's a living nightmare, breaking down reality. I have tried everything, and there is no way to fight back. You need to escape it as long as you can. Redeem us both, Daniel. Just... Whoopsie daisies. Well, shit happens. So, okay, you get the gist. We have to kill this fucking douchebag, Alexander of Brandenburg. Yes, obviously he did some pretty nasty shit. I'm assuming some experiments. Or what now, whatever they did back in the medieval times. And there's nothing else here I have to collect. No tinder boxes, no nothing, no TNT, no explosives, no grenades, oh shit, this ain't fucking Call of Duty. No, 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 this is an indie horror. Quite a good one, in fact. Okay, and I'll think I'll cut it off once I get into the entrance hall. Okay, hold well, on. He fell to the kitchen floor. Tears, tears were beginning to well in his eyes as he received the first kick to his stomach. His remained hidden in fear she too would be punished. That's nasty. Okay, fine. We're in the main entrance hall. This is as far as I got the last time. So I'll leave it here until part two. So far, game is pretty enjoyable. Like I said, played it before and. I uh, don't, don't know what, what to say really, I mean, the graphics look good, the ambience is brilliant. Let's keep me on the edge. Alexander, is it inside the castle? Of my seat. In a manner of speaking, come, bring the lamp. You've been to the refinery, have you not? I don't believe I have. Is it connected to the... what did you call it? The inner sanctum. My most precious chamber, Daniel. And it lies well beyond the refinery. In fact, it lies beneath the very stone of Brennenberg. Okay, before I got interrupted, yeah, that this puts an end to part one. I can't wait to play it again. Don't know when the second part will be uploaded. Maybe on Thursday. After I finish some important assignments, because yes, I'm in college, I have assignments to do, and I only do this in my spare time. Just as a hobby, and I like it. Maybe I'll actually go places. Who knows? But if you like, you know what to do. Like, rate, drop a comment, share, really helps out a lot. And I will see you in part number two. See ya.